Hello and welcome. My name is Jenny Shah and today we are going to discuss on a topic which is truly a very important and essential aspect of everyone's life which is how to overcome depression. Depression for that matter is a state of mind and how to overcome it there are a few very basic things which we need to follow and we will surely be able to overcome and fight depression. However, let me just suggest and recommend to you that if you're looking for an expert advice of a doctor, please visit a doctor who would be officially guiding you uh, into various sessions to get you out of depression. However, for me, I'm a life coach and my passion and my vision is truly to help you create a business and life that you deserve and you desire. So I would want to help you to overcome the state of mind which you are into. And the reason why I'm doing it is because I have been in your shoe. I have complete empathy of the situation which you have gone through or you are going through, which is something called as depression. And why am I saying that it's something? Because it truly is something. It is just a state of mind which comes and goes, just has the other emotional state of minds come and go. If you realize, you go through a series of emotions in a daily span of life. Even in fraction of a minute, you go through emotional states. Sometimes you're happy, sometimes you're irritated, sometimes you're sad, sometimes you're upset, sometimes you are really down. There are n number of things that we go through. And the only reason why we go through these things is because we are human beings and we have feelings and we have emotions. We all are connected and we all are built on emotions. So please understand, if a person says I am highly a practical person, he is also an emotional person because each one of us has something which we call as emotions. So friends, if you are into a state so-called depression, uh, how to overcome it is something which is not going to happen with a click of a button. It needs to be done with thorough motivation and focus. And here the point of focus is going to be only you. You have to focus on yourself and make up your mind whether you want to come out of it or you don't. Also, I would like you to be self-aware. Be aware of what exactly are you going through. Is it depression or is it stress? Because they are two different things. They would be having two different effects on you. Also, there are various reasons which put us into these states. So-called emotional states. Maybe it can be your health, your wealth, or your relationship. Broadly, if we try and categorize it, it can be either one falling into either one of the category. So friends, how are we going to fight depression or overcome it? So coming straight to the point, what you need to do is focus on something that you really love. Put all your focus and attention on something that you are passionate about. Point number two, you need to move out of the place where you are situated when you have started getting thoughts. For that, you need to be self-aware. When do we get into a stage of depression? We are not depressed 24-7. Okay? We, we cannot be depressed 24-7 unless and until it's a serious issue that you are having. So depression is something which, which comes to you. Okay? And it comes via your thoughts. What you need to do is control your thoughts to control the feeling of depression. And how are we going to control the thoughts is by, by taking charge and taking control of your mind. Do not let your mind control you. You should be in the power position to control your mind. I'm sure it takes some time for us to be able to get everything back. But if you decide there is nothing that you can't do, I have done it, so will you. 
Please understand, get control of your thoughts. Thoughts are the biggest devil that put you into that state which is called as depression. So what I do is, if I start realizing that I'm getting into the thought process, I just want to break the thought process. For that, I concentrate on, on my work. I concentrate on being on social media. I concentrate on my own self. Either by entertaining myself by watching TV, go watch a movie in the theater, leave the place which is, go which is giving you and putting you in the situation where you are right now. Just move out. Okay, listen to good music, entertain your own self. This is nothing but it is only about you as a person. So you need to make the center of focus your own self. You are the most important person. If you are in a sane condition, everything else will come to you. And if you are not, there is nothing with you. So coming back to fighting depression. Make yourself as a center of focus and concentrate on all your likes. Do something which is really passionate and near, to, near and dear to your heart. The reason why we have to do this is to avoid thinking. Avoid the thought process that is putting you into that stage. If it is a depression caused to you by, to, by your weight issue, okay, there is a separate series which we will be covering over it. So, however, depression broadly okay comes for various reasons to fight it there are particular uh, strategies that a person needs to follow if you focus up on a process you will surely be out of it process being concentrate on your own self first you are the center of focus do something which is really passionate to you near and dear to your heart when you realize you're getting thoughts which will put you in a position of depression, leave that place. Once you're out of that place, your state of mind changes because your place change. So that's the reason why people say, be amongst people. There are a lot of them who would say that, acquaint yourself with people. Talk out so that you are out of it. If you are a person who is, a, who is an extrovert, who would like to share things, go ahead, talk. If you are a person who does not or who would not like to share his or her innate problems, don't. There are many other things which you can do to come out of this state by your own self. However, for today, I have just given you three points which you need to cover to come out of the state called as depression. I would like to repeat this point again. Depression is nothing but a state of mind and you have the power of choice. You have the power in your hands to, to choose to be depressed or to choose to be happy. God has blessed us with the power and he has given us full control because the only thing that you can control is your own self and your own thoughts and your own behavior as well as your own actions. Do not let your mind control you. You have to take control and charge of your mind as well as your thoughts, as well as your behavior and your actions. So please make sure to stay fit and fine in health as well as in wealth as well as mentally, which is gonna keep you secure and sound. If you've liked this video, Please uh, press the thumbs up. If you want more of such videos, you can subscribe to my channel. Also, if you feel this might help a friend of yours, please share the video. Stay tuned and look in for more lot of videos which I am sure would help you to create a business and life that you love. My name is Jenny Shah. To get in touch with me, you can just leave a few comments in the comment box below and I would surely get back to you. I also am a blogger. My blog is www.jennyjenyshah.co.in. Thank you very much.